I'll finish this mission in an hour. Let's go. This game's quick and easy. There's been widespread speculation about this ambush on a French military convoy, but we don't have much to go on. Our primary concern is the Council Intel report indicating alien activity in the area. We need to secure the site and look for some clue as to what happened here. Objectives updated. Ten minute mission. Liv Blade is my friend. This is a ten minute mission. I mean, <laughs> one hour mission. Ten minute mission, shut the fuck up. This is a one hour mission. Okay. One pod right here of three. And then we got some spoiling gamers over here on the right. If I come around behind, it should be fine. I want to get all my soldiers next to the ladder to run up and shoot. Apart from the LMG, which I want to position like here for this turn. Okay, gamer children, let's go. 10 4. That should not activate, but just to be safe, probably take an extra little turn here to get around all this shit. Big on! Big on! If you walk through there, you will activate, so be careful. That is an activation path. A path to activations that some would consider unnatural. God, I turn off chat and I start doing prequel memes. The secret is that the chat is where I take all of my jokes from. I'm actually not funny at all. I was funny at first, before I started streaming, and I actually haven't been funny for like seven years. Back when I first started like live and impossible and like twitch like showing a bit more of my fun loving goofy self um people sent me like hate mail uh to my fan mail account being like beagle you're not streaming like you used to like you you you're like a you got like frat boy humor now like you know go, go back to the old beagle who was really calm and professional um you know and smart and mature and you know what? Turns out, I laughed at them at the time. I guess they were right. I haven't been funny for seven years. And now that the chat is off, I haven't got my comedy training wheels anymore. I've got no one to riff off of. Shit. Who am I going to steal my jokes from? This is fucking... I'm, I'm ruined. Okay, they're going to stay there. There's only two of them. Interesting. I want to kill them. That is how XCOM is played. You kill the aliens. Okay. I'm gonna bring the shotgun over and the grenade and I want I want to kill them. Cause I can't go to this ladder. They're for some reason they are specifically in the one position that ruins my ability to do the one plan I set out to do. Like why are you there? Go away. That's a weird place for you to be. Go away, you little weirdos. This is weird. You can hear like Beagle's crying. Like Moving. you can hear my voice breaking because they're not letting me do the one strategy I want to do here. I'm crying. I'm actually crying. Often big. Just let me do the fucking. Just let me do the fucking thing. I want to do the fucking thing. It's awful. I'm in tears. Uh, I should be able to make that. Vasponial. Russian is a really cool sounding language. Go here. There now. You Overwatch. I got it. I'm on my last motion tracker charge next turn. Hey, you hear anything? Where's Vanya? Where? Where the fuck do they go? I think they're all thin men too. What? <laughs> Holy shit, they're gonna breach me! I guess, let them? You might think you're smart if you say open the doors and counter-breach them right now, and I have no idea. Chat could be screaming to counter-breach right now, but they'd be wrong. In fact, I know it. Without even looking, I know chat is like, counter-breach them, counter-breach them! I bet you. I bet you that's what chat's saying right now. They're like, oh, open the doors, get them! Kill! Kill! I bet you. But that's wrong. Because what you'll do is you'll counter, you'll think you're so smart, and then the Thin Men will just jump up on the roof. And you will hate your life, and you'll stop playing XCOM. And you'll be in trouble, chat, because XCOM's how you make your money, and you'll go broke. So, what I'm going to do instead is I'm going to... Sun Tzu said, Never interrupt your enemy 
when they're in the process of making a mistake, and that's exactly what I'm gonna do here. I'm gonna, I'm gonna let them make, oh, I'm gonna let them make their big mistakes here, because they're about to make some big mistakes. Heading out. Big mistakes incoming from the Thin Men. They're about to walk through that door, and they're about to suffer. My wrath. Watch this, watch this. Oh. And with Daddy with the sawn off here, let's do it. Let's go. The sawn off Overwatch? Can you believe what you're seeing? Have you ever seen a sawn off Overwatch before, chat? Shut the fuck up. You're lying. You've never seen it. Oh, this is this is gonna be. <laughs> this is gonna be legendary. It's gonna be even live and legendary. Headed there now. Roger. Got my eyes on. Overwatch. Sawn off Overwatch. LMG Overwatch probably won't hit anything. Done. And fuck it. Close combat sniper Overwatch. Let, let's go. Let's go. Let's not. Let's not go. Um. Let's. Pistol Overwatch from here. What the hell is that? You fucking little shits! Die! Fucking... Oh, shit. I ult tab. Yo, I ult tab and they're dead. <laughs> Sick. That was me toggling my cheats on. It was actually me trying to do the angry face and hitting alt instead of shift. <laughs> But don't tell anyone. So that worked out decently. I wanted them to come through and get sawn off Overwatch, but all the other Overwatch went off. I mean, that was surprisingly kind to me, actually. Like, way more Overwatch went off there than I really would have expected. So that was pretty kind. We're gonna pursue now. There's no time limit on this mission, so it's all gravy. But we're gonna chase after him. Roger that. Try to hunt down that last little old thin man. Where is that last little old thin man? I mean, I, I literally watched where they went. Okay, they're there. So you gotta like grenade him or some shit. Uh, you can just HE grenade them. I think you're just gonna have to HE grenade them. To reliably kill them without revealing here because... Okay, where are they? They're right there. Because if you go out too far, you're going to activate the other pods behind that Thin Man. I feel like I need to see them though, because otherwise it won't do damage. So we're going to go like that. Uh, and then can I just like huck a nade over from someone? Someone like throw a... You, you, you little HE friend. Okay, like... Come to here and chuck it through that hole, okay? Hole. Here we go. This is like when they teach you how to throw grenades in Call of Duty. Like, this little hole is made to throw nades through. Oh, goodbye. So long again, Bowser. Ah, delicious. Okay, so that's first pod down. Go me. Now we're gonna go up to the ladder. Now we're going up to the ladder. Okay. Go me, that was rad. Good job, me. I'm gonna run up the machine gun. That was pretty awesome. Let's get some more go me's in chat. I don't know how many of you are saying it. And this is really like a... Like a prisoner's dilemma chat, because I'll never know if you're saying go me right now. I'll never look back on the VOD. So you can be saying the most horrible... The most horrible, fetid comments about me right now. I'd have no idea. You might not even be talking about me at all. You might be bored of me. I have no way to monitor that. But I like to believe that you're all saying nice things about me right now. You know? I like to believe that after that masterclass and killing those two thin men, you're all going, Wow, Beagle. Good job. That was well done. Beagle, you did a really good job. Beagle, you're my favorite XCOM streamer, and I love you. All right. I want to put some people over here on the right as well. So I'm gonna bring Moving. the shotgun around to here. 
And we're gonna do over here. And we're gonna go up next time. Gonna Overwatch. 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 And this is not usually how I take this. But I'm gonna try a brand new strategy for handling business here. Rather than just camping the doorways, I'm gonna take the high ground and smoke it. This is very new for me. This is brand new, shiny new technology for me. But we're gonna try it, here we go. The roof breach. The reverse roof breach. Breaching up a ladder, I've never done this before. I've revealed to myself two thin men and a sectoid. And I'm not gonna lie, uh, they're really not in positions I can shoot from the roof. <laughs> they fucking ran off. <laughs> ah! That's fine. I don't have to commit to the roof. I just want to. I don't have to do that. Maybe I could suppress the back thin men and kill this one. Yeah, 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 that, that, that should stick. What if I... Do, do you think I can see them from, from behind? Like, like, what if I can see them from up here? Okay, okay, okay. Go, 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 uh, okay. You know what, I'm just gonna commit to it. I'm gonna commit. I'm gonna commit, I'm gonna commit. I'm gonna go like this. Can I even see the guy? Probably. Can this see him? No? Fuck. Fuck, I can't even see him. Fucking god damn it! Oh, fucking god damn it! I thought I was smart, but I'm stupid. Uh, open this roller door. Maybe I can break loss instead. Yes, okay, I guess I could break loss instead. I could do the opposite. Okay. Sure, sure, you know what? Sure, let's do the complete opposite of what I was planning to do. And that'll be fine. We'll break loss. Okay, we'll break loss up here. Aye, aye. Okay, completely different strategy. Completely different plan. I'm gonna go back to the hole that is made for throwing grenades through. I'm gonna send the shotgunner out to do like a spoiling position on the right in case they try to flank me. And you know these little shits will try to flank me. You just know it. You know the fuckers will. So I come over here. I keep looking over to see what chat's saying about me. I'm so narcissistic. All I see is Blade, though. And it's honestly the first time this has ever worked for me, because I just like looking at that picture. Um, so I guess I'm going to suppress you and then break loss. Yes! Yes! Suppress! Got him covered. And I'm going to break loss. Uh, we're going to break loss, dude. No, not there, not there. Um, back here. Okay, back here. I'm gonna break loss. Yup, and I'm gonna hunker, 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 hunker. I've never done this before. This is an all new strategy for BT. Let's see how it plays out for me. He's gonna get acided for sure. He's for sure gonna get acided. That is, that makes sense. He's not gonna get acided by the other thin man though. And one of these fuckers should be a medic. No, that's the one I ran away. That's the one I revealed with. Okay, so they just got a hunker. Uh, Michael still can't see. The other thin man is still gonna be in the same position. Very suppressible. The grenade doesn't get rid of your cover there. I can just do it for fun. Okay, so this isn't working out great. The acid will on the units that aren't immune to acid is bad. I want to just hunker them in place and suppress this thin man, and then the other one moves up, I guess. And then when the other one moves up, I grenade them. I guess that's my strategy now. I guess that's my strategy now, okay. I want to... Cross over here of the scout and see if the sector is anything on my right. Doesn't look like it. I'm gonna suppresso you o. Uh, I think I'll overwatch over here in case the sector. No, I'll, I'll break loss in case the sector tries to mind frame me. You have to move just in case uh, the sector is trying some bullshit on you from over there. 
So I think come to here, because this sector might flank you through that APC. You gotta be careful. Uh, you've got suppression, so what I want to do is... I don't actually want to bring you back. The smoke will dis uh, the gas will dissipate next time I can come back and suppress. So hunker there for now. Hunker. Hunker. We're gonna hunker you all. Okay, we're playing a little bit passive. But as long as this guy doesn't do anything ridiculous, we're fine. You're just gonna spit the gunner? The gunner has an, a medkit, so that doesn't matter. As long as I don't try to kill them with gunner suppression reaction shots, it doesn't matter. That is fine. The real problem here would be if other thin men show up. Ah, because I'm like stuck in the smoke. The smoke is the real issue here. I needed to not... I needed to have these infantry rather than hunker here. They should have been back here so they couldn't get gassed. That was my mistake. Why well, is the first I've ever done this? I see that now. I see now that was my mistake. Okay, but Mitchell has shots now. And those shots are about to get even better because watch this shit. So I'm going to go looking for Lil Bobby Sectoid out here. I don't see Lil Bobby Sectoid, which means we are safe on the flank. Safe on the flank as you can move back to the Call of Duty grenade training hole. And we're in the grenade hole now, folks. Now we can throw the grenade over here and we can blow all of this shit up. And the only way this can be bad is if the infantry loses sight because the man isn't stepping out anymore. Nope. We good. We good. We good. Okay, he was a little confused with the acid at first. The, the, the gas kind of confused me, but he's got the spirit now. He's got the spirit now. We're good now. And now the gas is gone. The medic can come back. The medic has a 45. I don't really want to take that. I just want to suppress with you this turn. Next turn, the, the gas probably goes away. So suppress again this turn. You are gonna hide in the middle. So you don't get, you don't get sectored mind freight and bullshit. We're not gonna take actions of the acid of people. We're gonna wait till the acid wears off. Uh, we're gonna overwatch of you because the guy can't see you. And then we're just gonna hunker with you because you're in range of the shot. And you might get hit through suppression. I'm just waiting for the gas to go away on these guys. And once the gas goes away, I'm in good position. Okay, so we're gonna hollow again. I think this turn I need to just shoot. And if I don't, just, you know, just finish off with a motherfucking nady. Because I uh, other aliens might show up at any, at any point. I need to finish this guy off. Boom! Handled. Shit is handled. And that first turn... It is dig dang doogly dead. Yay! Okay, je surveille la zone. Yay! Where's the sexoid? I feel, Commander. Hunker. Hopefully the gas will wear off next turn. Hello, little baby. Oh, is little baby running for their diaper? Ah, oh, fuck, I missed. Fucking good. Yeah? Little baby gonna run again, high on acid? Well, little baby. And then there's more Thin Mans on the left. The acid should have just come good. Yup. Out of acid, out of acid. This is great. So now I have the power position. Alright. I, I have the power position so hard I can even move the gunner out to join the power position. That might activate because it was going forward and the door is open, but I don't care. Power. MJB power position. I hope Lloyd Boy is here so he uses the power remote. Okay, so that's done. Little acid up baby is not a big threat to me anymore, so I'm going to bring the shotgun back. I'm not worried about the acid of that baby flanking me. I'm going to come back. Grenadier is going to stay down here to do grenade things. We're going to reload. I am going to steady the sniper. Reload, reload, boom. This is going pretty good. The sector is killing itself on drugs. I love that. Yay! Cap! Just running around in a fucking hallucinogenic haze. I love that. That's great for me. I love that. 
Yeah, now we just chill, man. Now we're just straight chilling. You like, I, I bring the shotgun up and the shotgun comes and joins the Overwatch cadre. And this is how we do it. Okay, this is how we do it. I have all high ground Overwatch. This is a good position to be in. And I'll only pull when they get to here because I'm on a 45 degree angle looking downwards now, unless they're on the roof. Um, it makes it less likely that I pull way back, which is good because the closer I pull, the less good positions they have. So that's a good thing. That's a good thing, chat. That's a good thing. What the fuck? No, no, don't do that. What the fuck? Oh my god. What the shit? Okay, you didn't activate. That's fine. I think you just hopped down to like an awning. Yeah! Wow, awning runner! What a cool path that almost got me into shit, but it didn't. So what a cool path. Yes, Commander. In the Vagong. In the Vagong. I'm going to sniper back to here, I think. Let's do this. Some of the LMG. I'd like to move the LMG back as well. Maybe next turn they'll be in range for that. In the Vagon. You know, Russian sounds cool. You know what's another cool sounding language? Chinese. That's a cool sounding language. Oh shit, the sector is off drugs. They can mind fuck me. No, get away from that gas. Gas, get away from that guitar amp. Uh, do I have any hollow? No. I have good shots though. Goodbye. You can't play the guitar. Even though you're high, you still can't play the guitar. Three, four, and go, go here, gunner. On the move. I can't smoke everyone with the same smoke now is the problem, no, it, but it's like what? One, three, five, seven, 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 five. Okay, I see what I need to do. I need to bring... You back here. Steady weapon. I think I'm ready to welcome chat back into my life. They've all gone. They've all left. What was it like for me not being here? Back in. Did you like it more? Or less? Peaceful? Better? <laughs> SWF writes, like being in Dante's purgatory, able to see the light of God but not allowed to feel it upon you. Nah, JK, it was chill. Oh, fuck you. I liked your first answer. The first answer was better. That's the kind of slavish... Slavish dick riding that I expect of you all upon me. Beagle knows best. Beagle's brain is the size of a house. I don't think for myself. I. We have voted upon a new ruler. Hey, what the fuck? Oh, it's how long? It's how long I'll take to do the mission, okay. Most people were listening, less typing. Yeah, man, I'm, I'm the life of the party. Not this mission, we're good. Don't worry, we're good. We've already made a good inroads into this mission. We've already killed two pods. I think we're gonna have to go get the other one though, unfortunately. I don't think the other pods coming to me. I think they're gonna stay on patrol left and right. So I probably wanna get off the roof for that. Yeah, their they're, they're totes not coming. I'm gonna have to go get them myself. Um, Rambo says, has Beeks decided when to play Terra Invicta or should I go check the VODs? Oh no, I already played it, bro, and I didn't save the VOD. I played Terra Invicta and I deleted the VOD afterwards. Because it was a game so good. That. 
people couldn't see it. Okay, I can't go any of this joke. I haven't played Terran Victor. <laughs> I haven't played it. I'm gonna be with the first Terran. What's up, baby? Drew it myself. How much did my VTuber cost? Only my chat's time. Only two minutes of my chat's time. Times 400 viewers, that's uh, 800 minutes. Fuck, that's a long time. I guess I gotta go back to the full cover. I don't really want to, but I guess I have to. I mean, the high cover did work for me. The high cover works if, like, you get a turn to exploit it. Like, if I had breached up and there were aliens here, I could have thrown my grenades and taken shots and used the high ground. Or if aliens puffed into me, I would get to use the high ground because I'd have a whole turn to shoot them and kill them before they can shoot back. But the problem is, if I activate the aliens back here, I will not get to kill them, and they will get to move in and shoot me, and that's not going to cut it in half cover. I'm going to be like hunkered in full, so I'm going to have to handle this. So we're going to go back down to the full cover. Yeah, they're not coming. Oh, they're so close! Can you hear them though? They're so close. Maybe just like keep... Maybe just like a couple more turns. Maybe, maybe they're close. They might be close. They're not close. They're, they're like teasing the edge right now. They're right. Oh, you can hear their feet. They're right on the edge. Fuck. All right. I gotta go back to the full cover. Yeah, hate to see it, but I've gotta go back to the full cover. Yeah, they, they are literally edging me. Yeah. Oh, well. Edged by gene splice snake feet. No spaghetti time. No horny. Calm down. No, I'm just kidding. It's my channel. Be as horny as you want. I'm just joking. Just doing a big old joke. I don't know where to go. Here, I guess. Here. Through the door. Nah, here, fuck it. Roger that. <laughs> oh, it scared me, fuck. Why are loud noises funny to me? I don't know. Like, I feel like it's common. Like, a lot of people find loud noises like that funny. Like, that's what makes funniest home videos even funny to me. Like, as, a, as a, like a genre, I know that show doesn't exist anymore. It probably does, but it probably just watches TikToks now. But like when I watch like a like a quick like five second clip of like just slapstick humor and like this really loud like noises like that, it just makes me laugh. Loud is funny. It's so funny. I love when like a clown falls into like a table and like the table is made of wood and glass and it just like breaks and shatters and it's so loud. That's so funny. Like when a jester. A jester like falls on something and it breaks. That's so funny to me. I love that. Okay, je surveille la zone. Because it's so loud. It's funny. No love for the last race of the clown, guys. Well, it's, it's a prank table. It's not real. Obviously, I mean, you obviously never. Like, watched many clown routines. It was obviously, it's a prank table. Obviously. Like, like, duh. Duh, chat. It's like when an assault. No, that's not funny. That's not funny. It was real with a clown. No, that's, that's mimes. You're thinking of mimes. ADHD Andy, I just might be. Covering now. Maybe I am. Maybe I am, chat, maybe I am. Yeah, I'll that says you mean that assault that got shot through the door. Here's the thing. The assault getting shot. Oh, it's just Delta getting shot. 
was not funny. But like, okay, imagine. Does anyone have a clip? Does, does anyone have a clip of? Oh, it's just Delta getting shot. No, no, no. Trust me, it's for a bit. But like, imagine, oh, it's just Delta getting shot, but it makes like this noise. Hang on, is this the sound I want? Julian! <laughs> I don't know where. Like, that'd be funny, right? I should put that on my soundboard and use my soundboard again. <laughs> Alright. Um, bring the gunner over here? No. Stay there. Steady aim, and we're gonna move up. Ripple my rat coin and betting beagle can be fast. I am gonna be fast. One and a half hours is easy. I'm gonna finish this like within an hour, I told you. Half an hour left, easily. Hey, we gonna be done in like half an hour. It's gonna be so easy. You don't even understand. Shit's easy. On my way. Here they come. So for example as well, three thin men. If you guys lost the rat coin bet, it would feel bad. But in half an hour when you guys lose the rat coin bet, if I play that sound effect again, it will be funny. See? You get how it works? Humor. Speaking of laughing, I keep seeing the name Magna Farda and it's really amazing, thank you. I would like to grenade this little shit bag. I would like that. I don't want to make the mistakes of the old world again where I get acided. I just massively acided. Do you reckon I could make that grenade? No. The answer is no, I could not make that grenade. I would have to be like, out here. It's not worth it. I mean, what if I do that? What if I just break loss? They can't stop me, right? Like, they can't stop me from breaking loss. Like, I'm allowed to do that. What if I just fucking break loss? Then they, then they can't gas me. Fuck it! Then they can't do anything! I've become ungovernable. I'm gonna break loss. You didn't break it right. Go back to here. Go back to here. That's right, Los. Los, exactly. On the move. Oh, I forgot to take my sniper shot first. Oh, I'm sad now. Got it covered. What? No! 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 Okay. Now you might think it's funny to laugh at me, but it isn't. Because I didn't play the sound effect. Hang on. Julian. Now you can laugh. I tried to double tap 2 to steady aim, but because I haven't got snapshot yet, I can't. The, the shot thing went away, so 2 became smoke grenade. That was dumb. I'm, I'm, I'm a big dumb idiot. That was dumb. Oh, they're gone. They broke loss on me. Delightful. That's always delightful. Oh, and they've still broken lost on me even more competently than I did. That's delightful. Spaghetti Times says knowing when to laugh with the help of the sound effect has taken the burden from my life. Yeah, it's like the shit we were saying about God and religion. You're welcome.
Yeah, I mean, that sniper is very safe now, yeah. Absolutely. Feel officially the laugh track. I will plug in the, the soundboard again. Watch out. I think they're up high, and I think they're about to show up like on this car or dash to here. Let's see. Let's watch, chat. Let's find out. <laughs> they never see it coming. They never see it coming. The man with a brain that was too big. Folks, he's got an unbelievably big brain. You come here. And then we're gonna chuck you one of these ones. Spawner, don't you talk talk about my mortgage again. Spawner, I don't wanna hear nothing from you. Except for yes, Commander, I shotgun the fade. Snipe this thin man. Uh, you can suppress, right? Yep. Okay, we got them dead to rights, kids. They're gone. Cancel those human phasers. Cancel. Cancel them so fucking hard. It is fucked up, all the human face they do, though. But it's not. You can't be racist to humans if you're aliens. I don't know, Beagle. The Ethereum's doing a genocide. Maybe you can. <laughs> Maybe you can, actually. <laughs> Maybe the humans, uh... What? Ma ma yeah, th that was the type of XCOM 2. Yeah, ma maybe maybe you can, actually. <laughs> well, they're all dead. It's mission easy. That was it, right? I think it was just three of them. Yeah, I remember saying three thin men, Vasily. Mango Master says, what's more important, stopping racism or stopping a genocide? Why is it a trolley problem? Why can't I do both? Yeah, okay, well. Oh, is that it? Well, 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 chat. Look who's got all the contact wipes. And it's not even Tuesday. Well, well, well. Is my strong man beagle now? It's the question. You mean straw man? <laughs> it's my strong man. I like that better. Can we just call them strong men from now on? What a strong man argument. <laughs> I love that. What a fucking strong man argument. Let's do this. <laughs> That's great. I love that. That's fantastic. That's right, a strong man argument has no fallacies. Too strong for you. SWF says, that's like when you ignore the opponent's argument and then go lift a truck instead. Yeah, that's like when I'm mad online arguing and then I just put a picture of Blade up and I look at that instead. God, I should use this for more shit. You gotta have someone ready here because the thin man will drop into this spot exactly. Um, having a shotgunner does help for that. I think I'm gonna send... I'm gonna send you. I said, do you guys like it when I make that humming noise or do you not like it? I'm on it, Commander. Dr. Ryu says I drew myself as the Chad warrior. Yeah, that, that's the that's a good example of a strongman argument, I guess. Locked and loaded. Cool argument. Those bodies don't look like they've been hit by alien weapons fire. Oh my god. These men were killed by conventional bullets. Holy fuck. That scares me. What's you guys' favorite languages? Moving. I feel like we've done this before. Hottest language chat. The language that is the most... 
aesthetically appealing to you. Go. Or accent. I will accept accent as well. That kind of ruins it, but fuck it. Maybe we should do accent afterwards. I already know accent. I already told you mine, so that's all that matters is what I like. Is that PNG tuber supposed to be Beagle? It is Beagle! It is me! Huh. Valus is whatever my wife speaks. <laughs> Got him. Okay, je bouge. The Beagle had dark ears. The Beagle had dark ears. I'm not a literal Beagle. Do you people think I'm literally a Beagle? Like literally the breed of dog that was the star of Cats vs. Dogs? Because I got news for you, I'm not. Pizza said, so far C hash is my favorite, even though I've used MATLAB to Octave the most because- No wait, shit, I can't make fun of engineers, they pay all my bills. They're always the richest people in my chat who donate the most. Fuck, tell me more. Please tell me more about programming languages. I mean, they're literally like wizards to me. I don't know why I would ever make fun of a coder, because it's the easy nerd dunk. You know, he expects it, they expect it when they write it. But actually my life revolves around coders. I, I need to, like, invite more coders to my cult. Yes, Commander. Sensors still indicate life signs in the area, Commander. Objective updated. Yeah, I... Yeah, I mean, SWF is a coder. That's a crazy thought. I've never thought of him as a coder. Because I think of him as the Chad Wojak. Yeah, I, I, I agree, Subjuji. I think coding is like wizardry to me. I've said as much. That's affirmative. Essentially, coding is like wizardry to me. May as well be. Oops. Okay, let's grab you. Uh, actually, hang on. I'm gonna send some of the infantry up high first. I'm gonna stick you here. I'm gonna stick you here. I'm gonna stick you over here. It's because streamers are bullies. I'm a bully, chat. I just see an example to make fun of someone. I take it. If we can bring them in for questioning, maybe we can figure out what happened here. That's wrong. It's wrong that I do that. Yes, Commander. You might as well leave me here. I have nothing to say to you people. It looks like he's the only witness to survive this fight. And for all we know, he was one of the aggressors. We need to bring him in. Whether he likes it or not. Why would you assume that just because he's French, New Bradford? Objective received. Um... Subject G says, I wish coding was as exciting as blasting someone of an innervating array. Sometimes it gets so Isn't that like hacking? That's like hacking, yeah? I'm s I'm betting so much on the thin man coming in on this flank. I'll fucking shock on Overwatch it. But then I don't have a shotgun shot if it misses. But if it's point blank, it's not gonna miss. Nothing can go wrong. I should have SMG Overwatch. <laughs> Why did I do that? What is wrong with my brain? Why did I do that? <laughs> I don't think I would have seen them anyway. It's alright. Okay, I want to run up to here. I want to throw a big daddyums grenade right there. Big daddyums, and then I'm gonna come to here. I'm gonna shoot him. Yeah, it's gonna be so good. Oh fuck, I can't see you at all. Oh fuck. Oh shit. Oh fart. Fuck. This is only the beginning. It's only a matter of. <coughs> oh fart. Okay. Shit. 
So you're gonna come to here. Wait, what? You can be seen from there? No, you're lying to me, fucking game. Oh, but you can't throw the nade. That's very interesting. I'm very to hear that. Okay, I can just throw it like there. I'm gonna blow up those boxes. I hated those boxes anyway. Fuck those boxes. And then I just gotta get a nice little shooty shot. Ooh, perfect. Ooh, what a nice little shooty shot. Hang on, am I gonna fucking die though? No. No, I'm not gonna fucking die. I'm just gonna move to here. And I'm gonna take a nice little shooty shot right there. And as long as nobody misses, everything's real chill here. 58% to crit. You have the same chance to crit. Ah, uh, fuck. Beagle, they they won't miss. The point is, Beagle, they won't miss. But just in case, who can the pistol? Uh, who can the sniper see? The the piss the pisser. Who can <laughs> who can the pisser see? Uh, okay, you can see there. I have a weird angle I can see here. No. So I'd have to hop down to here, at which point I cannot be seen. Cannot be seen. Can see. Okay, so go for the back one first. That's what I'm seeing here. Go for the back one first. What if I kill Niver? Wait, what if I kill Niver doing that? Oh, shit. Wait, can I get an AP grenade on them? Ah, yes. Wah! Copy that. Save the day, speed bump. Yes! Thank God speed bump had this AP grenade or this would have been really awkward. Thank goodness. Okay, it's still a little bit awkward. But it won't be awkward after you hit your shot. Is pistol better? Nope. It won't be awkward after you hit your 90%. Hey! We did it. Good news, chat. We did it. Time to motor. Well, I think we all learned some very important lessons there about snipers and LMGs being too far away to help things. Covering now. Did my chat break or did you just all stop talking for three minutes? That's weird. I feel like my chat broke. Hey, someone say something. No, I'm just that boring. Never mind. <laughs> oh, if I waited five more seconds, Ingridon would have answered that for me. <laughs> now to do my Joker laugh again. Society. Surprise, this game hasn't broken you. It kind of has, but I came out stronger. Do you know those shows where it's like, you beat me, but I came back stronger? That's like me with like mental illness in XCOM. Will do. Yes, man. Rock and roll. Rock and roll. Time to move again, little VIP exalt man. You're nothing but puppet. A bunch of puppets. My own puppets. I'm on it, Commander. Aaron says I was sleeping. A hee hee hee. No, aren't you cute? Headed there now. Roger. Got my eyes on. Okay, okay. This time, the shotgun Overwatch will hurt. You're already dead. You're about to get fucking Jojo'd. Maybe. I wanna... I wanna, like, sawn off on you, but if the sawn off doesn't do enough damage, I die. 
Excuse me, I do a burp. So maybe don't do that. Actually, that's Fist of the North Star. Oh yeah, shit. It's Ken, my bad. They're really dropping in an annoying position, but that's alright. I'm gonna make this work. Damn, I blew up all the fucking cover, shit. Okay, um... I think... I will get shot if I run that. I do just want to like run up and shotgun you, but I, I don't want to fucking suffer the consequences when I'm wrong for doing that. But if I run along here, I'm gonna get shot through the door because yeah, it's surprising you guys have me ready. He's actually kind of got me pretty pinned here. Oh, I can't make that move anyway because I go through the fucking glass skylight. Um, I think this move stops me from getting overwatched maybe. Yes, I think this is maybe the move. I think if I make this move, I'm safe. Or definitely this move. Because I'll get spotted right here, but then I'll instantly disappear from... Oh, I was even spotted there. Nice. Nice one. Nice one. Copy that. And you to here. You need to hide. Uh, you need to go here. Getting it done. Oh god. What? What? Oh. Holy shit! I was not expecting to get spotted on that run. That's the funny thing. I was expecting to get spotted on this run, not that one. You're telling me the thin man. Like what? I guess I'm stepping out there? But you've only seen me for one tile, you shouldn't... You still shouldn't be able to see me. That's wacky. Anyway, lucky you didn't get hit because you would have straight up fucking died, kid. Whoa, you were almost a sniper sandwich. That's crazy. This is a waste of time. Come here. How much time? We got? Now you're like 10 minutes from my par, I think. It's awkward because he can take the roof now. There's, there's really awkward position for that thin man to be in. Clever and awkward position. Full hunker. The LMG stays on the roof in case he goes on the roof and then I can suppress back and I'll probably survive the oh fuck he didn't do anything. He's really trying to make the bet get lost. Okay, he's here now. He's coming for my tutti fruity butt. He's just hiding back there. What a what an absolute genius brain. Fucking Fucking smart as hell, Thin Man. So clever. In reality, the Thin Man's just scared. Thin Man's just like, oh my god, please, I don't want to. I don't want to die. I am going to move you to here. And I move you over to here. Wait, no, I gotta move the VIP too. Um, I'm gonna move the VIP over to here. What are you trying to prove? So I can abandon the roof finally, in a second. You're gonna come cover my rear in case there's more drop-ins. Um, Sniper needs to come over and help you. Or get ready to help you. Come over here. Good 
And then you're gonna rush me. I gotta, like, abandon this position, I think. Yup. And then you're gonna stay up here on high ground, I guess. Hunker. Hunker. Overwatch, Overwatch. Hunker. Yep, more drop-ins. Fuck. I just wanted to get off that roof so I can move the others. But depending on where the drop-ins come in, it could be really bad. Wait, who can you see? Oh, you see the gunner. That's fine, so now I've got- Now they're not such a threat anymore because I can suppress them. So it's- No, not now! Not after- Oh. It's a sectoid. And a thin- I feel like I've played this exact turn before. That's a sectoid 2. That was a sectoid 2, I swear. Was that a sectoid 2? I've had that literal exact sequence of events happen to me, complete of not knowing if that was a sectoid or a thin man. I've had- I've played that exact turn before. One, two, three, four. Who has grenades? There's a literal double. Literal double thin man there. Oh, my grenades are too far away. I'm gonna cream myself. I see port still sucks. It, it sure does, champ. Oh, that really does suck. Yowza. Yowza, that really does suck. Survivor needs to come over here now and make it to evac. Sniper, I mean, Shadow Rai is gonna get off the roof now, I think. And we're gonna like lure them off the roof. We're gonna like full break loss now. I don't really like it, but I feel like the scout has to run all through Overwatch's. Why did you move the VIP up? Well, you said that he's alive anyway. Because I wanted to bring the other units in to deal with the dangerous thin men, and I thought maybe I could get away with it, but there was a three man drop waiting. This is why you have to have the guy controlling the roof, but then this fucker forced me off the roof. Fuck. And I'm out of grenades. Fuck. Oh, I'm out of grenades at the worst point in the mission, too. Literally the worst point to run out. Oh, you can see him from there too. How about that? Alright, well, I think you just gotta run this, okay? I just have to run the Overwatch. I'm sure it'll be fine. 4%. Oh, only one of them was on Overwatch. Good. 9%. We're good. We're good, we're good, we're good. Okay, now we can hide. This lot will get gassed for sure. But I guess it's okay. Um, where do you go? Uh, you probably like go back to here, right? Yeah, you go, you go to like here. Okay, and then the gunner's gonna come to here. And the scout goes there. The worst part about this is we're probably going to get gassed. That is the worst part. I'm on it, Commander. Everything by the I want him to hit me with the gas. That's awful. I should really go here back and return fired. You're going to have to hunker, though. And then the survivor has to run over to here. And then you with the AP grenade, I would love to bring you closer, but I kind of can't. Fuck. Should have here and covered the, the, bit, the bullshit. 
Maybe run the sniper back too. No, the sniper can't do anything. Just hold there. Kind of worried about the next turn with like the high ground shit on me, but I don't, at least I broke loss. At least I broke loss. So that's a victory in itself. You know, that's that's a little victory. Looks like the aliens are sending in reinforcements. An oh, another wave. Okay, I'm fucked. I just triggered all the reinforcements at once. I did not think there was yet another wave. I have fucked myself this mission. Oh, there they are. One. Oh, and I have not really many ways to deal with that. Okay, that's like the last one though, probably, right? I can suppress you, but then if it doesn't kill... I feel like I just have to run the Overwatch. Not great. I really don't want to just run the Overwatch. If I just put an AP grenade on you... Can a Thin Man even do 7 damage? XCOM Companion. XCOM Companion, let's look up Thin Man. Thin Man. Damage range, 4 to 6. 4 to 6, kids. If Flank doesn't kill you, you can hope the Suppression does. Probably better chance to run Overwatch. Oh, because they'll run the Suppression? Yeah! No, 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 no. Because they'll just kill the Flanker or the Suppressor as well, AI-wise. The rare moment when I disagree with Bounty. Also because I think what will happen is that... Because the because this shot cannot crit, running this is the most reliable way to live. It will probably put someone in the sick bay for ages, but it, it, it you cannot die. If their damage range really is four to six, I can't die doing this. Unless I mean you're not a navigator, so yeah, I, I can't die doing this. won't happen. What else happened? Uh, that fucker's there. Where are the rest of the fuckers? There's still one here. Now there's one there. It's tempting to flank that one, I won't lie. There's a flank spot of exposing yourself to this one. What do you mean? Oh, I wish I could run along cover here, but I, I can't do that either. Semantic has it, yeah. I want to take the Overwatch along cover. Because that really lowers the chance of it hitting you. I don't think I can. I don't think I can do that. I'm going to pull in the non-covered spot. That fucking sucks. I mean, I, I could not... If... I go to here and use the grenade. But then if the grenade just kills, I'm gonna feel really stupid. But if the grenade just kills anyone, I'm gonna feel really stupid. I mean, well, here's the thing. They can't kill me. The Thin Man can't kill me on the Overwatch. I just said that. So if I shoot, then grenade, I might be able to avoid taking any damage here. I wonder where the other fuckers are. I feel like they're right above me here. And that is frightening. Where's my stupid scout? Stupid shotgun moron idiot scout. Okay. I can't see. I can't see where the fuck they are. Alright. Bear yourself out of this problem here. You're gonna do that, and then you're gonna throw the nade if it doesn't work. Shotgun sh I mean, infantry shoot. Of course, of course. A horse is a horse, of course, of course. And then just like AP dead on. Please. Yes! Fabulous. Okay, remove that motherfucker. Now I need to run the scout away, I think. So I can hide. Good to go. So it doesn't look like there's any Thin Mins up here on the edge camping me. So that's pretty cool. 
So I should really run these two away. I'm kind of worried that the engineer is like getting stuck over here though, you know what I'm saying? The engineer is kind of getting a bit, a bit stucky. A bit locked in. They require assistance. I don't know where the rest of them have gone though. There's like two more aliens, where did they go? What is their plan? What are they cooking? What the fuck are they doing up there? Are they just sitting in the same spot? What are they doing? What the fuck are they doing? I got no clue. Um, I would like to run Shadow Ray back, I think. I would like to run you away. I'd like to run the sniper away. I think I have to run you back to the right now. Because I need to run the LMG over here in case there's Overwatch. Which there isn't. And then I need to hide you over here. Yeah, kind of scared for the engineer, honestly. Gray, gray two dubs, you're... Kind of in a scary position. I don't think they can jump this, which is my, like, saving grace. But I'm still kind of scared. You're gonna have to hunker. You know, Overwatch with you. Hunker with you. I'm not gonna go for the flank, because I feel like that just gets me killed and the SMG doesn't kill. Ashleted. No, I know you want attention in Grenoble, but I ignored that the first time. I'm going to ignore it this time, too. Hmm. Our friend the engineer is in some level of distress. Jorg says, when I played this mission, I had the VIP hungry in the same spot, and I think I rolled a 5% and killed him. Wait, they can see him from the roof? I was worried about that. So, Beatrice is in a level of distress here that is not good. They're not Overwatching now, which is weird. Yeah, well, th there's four aliens, right? So one of them might still be Overwatched. We don't know that none of them are on Overwatch. I feel like I gotta roll out big for my boy engineer here, but I'm kinda scared. Can I break loss? I can flank. If you can advance and get rid of them, the engine you can bail yourself out. Yeah, but I don't, think, I don't think I can get rid of any of them, is the thing. I don't think I've got any like good options for that. I'm gonna like run you forward, scout. Okay, there's one. So they're, they're doing like weird shit. Okay, they're doing fucking weird shit. They're doing real fucking weird shit. You can come to here and you can shoot that fuck. But I need you to smoke. Can you get that smoke? Uh, fa la la. Where is the sectoid? If the sector's up on the roof, that's a big problem for me. But I could run Kevin Critical to here, and then throw a smoke over to the bench, which will be necessary for them to survive. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh god, I don't know if I can even get that smoke, honestly. I don't even know if I can. I can pull it off. Yang got hollow, and the 1% probably ain't gonna happen, so... Probably just take this shot. Destroyed. That's a thin man down. Uh... Now I gotta get some cover going here for my, my poor little NG who's gonna be so fucked up. So, so, so fucked up. Sick video room, my guy. Thank you, Matt, Matt. Thank you very much. I made it myself. Uh, it's 
smoke from here reaches there, but then you probably get flank killed. But without smoke, that scout definitely dies. Problems, problems. One, two, three, four. Jesus, can I even get the NG? From here, right? I'm like, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight tiles off me. We'll hit that smoke. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I don't think I can save the NG either way. Banny says it depends on what you want to disrepate the sector. You can get Sniper in the open to get rid of Thin Man 2 and NG soft last. Um, Sniper doesn't have, st doesn't have snapshot is the only problem. Yeah, Sniper has no snapshot. I can come to here and then I can probably get the smoke, right? I can probably get the smoke there. No, probably not. Anybody else got smoke? Oh, like... Like zoink, scoob, like maybe I can make that? Here, just move and see. Yeah, it's low rank sniper. Everybody's low rank. My roster is fucked up. Terminally fucked up. Okay, three, five, seven... Three, five, seven... Seven, seven, five, three. I think this smoke just catches you. Seven, five, three. Yeah. If you can get it right there in the end of the rubble, seven, five, three, we trust. Smoke will extend to here. Yeah. Seven, five, three. Okay. I am a bit worried about Kevin Critico getting fucked up in, like, return by either dissected on the roof or the thin man doing something goofy, but... It does seem like this is by far my best move. Yeah, I think this is by far my best move. And then, like, I guess you just have to overwatch in case the sectoid comes within range, or we can move you to here. To cover the Thin Men next turn, probably. And then, like, have the Sniper. Steady aim or something. Okay. Dark Flagler says, if the Engineer dies because of that accidental Sniper use of smoke earlier, that's a big oof. Oh, yeah, the Sniper could have thrown it. Not that it really matters, but yeah. Okay, so you're going to run back. Wait, we're going to throw the smoke first. Fuck it. Seven, five, three. Smoke goes out first. This mission is taking a little bit longer now. Because I made it harder. Because I thought you guys would appreciate the content. You're gonna run to here. You're gonna get acid, which fucking sucks. Sectoid, 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 sectoid. There is the sectoid, and the sectoid is not on Overwatch. Based. Now you're just gonna survive the Thin Man shots. I think the little fucker's here. If I could get, like, some kind of suppression or something on him, that would be amazing. Okay. Fuck. My butt. Fuck my big butt. Oh, could you have moved down to here? Wait, you're the medic! They gave him a position. You have no idea the level of brain I just I just used. I thought I was moving a medic to the right to suppress, was upset because I could not get the suppression from there, wished, oh, I wish I'd moved the medic down here instead of the infantry, then realized, oh my god, I thought the medic was the infantry. I fucked it up. Big brain! Massive brain! Holy shit, my, my brain is... It's huge. Now, the one inside, I probably smoke here, because the one inside can run over and fuck me. Fuck my big medic.com. So I need to suppress you. I need the LMG to run up. Oh, you reckon in a half cover? I reckon into. I reckon in a half cover. To try and pull fire. You haven't got will to survive yet. But I reckon you've got a much better shot of surviving the two Thin Men than anyone else, because they both have to hit you. So you know what? Go into half cover and draw fire. Don't go into the smoke. Intentionally do not use the smoke. Sniper moves up. Survivor waits right there. 
And I think you need to smoke the medic. Hua! Now it's just, can we survive the two Thin Men shots? And I'm betting on the, the gunner being able to tank, only getting hit by one and then tanking the other. I mean, dodging the other. Okay. So basically, if the other Thin Man hits the gunner, I lose this bet. Because that shot already would have killed... That shot already would have killed one of the others. Oh yeah, we're aciding. Oh, and we're aciding. Oh, and we're aciding. Oh yeah, we acided the gunner, which is useless. Yes! That was, uh, five, actually. They would have lived, right? The engineer would have died because the engineer's acid. They would have taken more damage. Oh, yeah. Big brain, big brain, big brain. And I have already flanked the position I want to use next turn. Because my brain are big. I got a bigger brain. Roger that. Oh, mamma mia, I got a bigger brain. Yes, yes, yes. A bigger brain, insected brain? Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, even bigger. Are you acided? Yeah. I want to go back in and like shotgun you now. I can do that with you. I can shotgun the, the scout. Who to kill, who to kill, who to kill. The second is the least dangerous opponent here. And I can probably shotgun you. I want to kill the back thin man, I think. I want to try and kill the back thin man. Yeah! Good shot, Mitchell! USA! USA! And now I'm going to try to shoot you. Yeah, because I can suppress my vote. Yep. Who's got hollow? I reckon it's almost better to actually make it an 80% because the sectoid is unlikely to kill me. Still could though, still could kill the gunner. Hollow first, yeah. I think I gotta hollow the thin man first. Because otherwise I think I could be in some real trouble here. So I'm gonna hollow you first. Because I don't want to miss that 70, I want to hit this. If the thin man goes down, we're in a lot better situation for next turn. And it might not kill, in which case the suppression might be useful for finishing. Okay, probably what I do here though is actually like uh, move the shotgun up the finish. Yeah, as long as we make sure the Thin Man isn't going to be in play, this is uh, good for us. 88, fuck you. Yeah! That hollow is essential there, I think, for all that. Okay, and now I just need the NG. Who is acided to sit still? Okay, sit still because you're acided. But I need someone to make sure that the sector doesn't get really wise and like. I don't need to make that flank anyway, but um. Okay, maybe just like. Where can I go? Where can I go? I can go here. Might even be able to see the sector from here. Hello? No? No, okay, I'm gonna take it anyway. I'm gonna go like to here. Up on up I'm gonna man the turret. <laughs> uh, and then the sniper is gonna be the one to come to here and make it so if this little shit tries to take that position, they're flanked. Double time. I'm gonna hunker you in place. That is my big turn. What is the sector gonna do? 49% from Kevin Critical! Oh, baby! Yeah. Nobody's dying today. We're good. We're good. From the turret, that's right. On the big 50. Dunk, 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 dunk. This looks like a fucking grenade launcher, actually. No, it's like a little 50. Dunk, 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 dunk. It's like a little Fennec scout car. One minute, go, go. Oh, shit! Fuck, really? I got one minute left. Ah! <laughs> oh shit! 
My bad. Oh, there's more! You guys are making me fucking in kill people! Ah! Oh! Oh! We're still good! Ah! Just hit the 30s! Go! Go! Stop! Wait, did that just misclick? No, it misclicked! <laughs> it's over! It's over! It's over! <laughs> it's an easy game, we just like to have fun here. Hey, who bet on me not finishing it in time? I, I did it, right? I did it? I think I did it. Do the- do the payout. Some- someone do the payout. Yeah, there you go, and now you're losing your money, and... <laughs> you guys only lost that because Bounty reminded me. I didn't realize how close I was to the timer there. Bounty. Bounty getting it in. <laughs> Cause you hit those overwatches. Yeah, if I hadn't hit that overwatch, Bounty like, you guys like baited me into playing like shit. Cause I was like, oh, I gotta make the timer in one minute. There won't be another thin man. And then the other thin man probably could have killed someone. You guys have no idea how close we came to someone dying there. Someone probably like gets fucking killed in that position that I left them in. <laughs> and then they just hit the 30s, fucker. Just kill that thin man. Oh man, well that's your extra mission today, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Guys, girls, NBs, non-binary non fire gaming. I've got a fun time. There you go. Jeff says one minute was nonsense. You had eight minutes before the hour and a half limit you set yourself. Oh! <laughs> so I was going fine. But, but Bounty believed in me, and I love that. I love that Bounty believed in me so much that Bounty knew they could make me think there was only one minute left. Bounty says, I think I read the wrong minute. I read it on the world because of the uptime. <laughs> Bounty was like, Beagle, you're so good at this game. You can play faster. Bounty is the person who knows that inside me, there is like a Dragon Ball Goku type character. I could beat Long War in like two weeks of game time if I pushed myself. But I just don't push myself. That last Overwatch turn there where I just knew the Overwatch would just hit. I just gotta play every turn like that. People will complain. They'll be like, I can't tell what's going on. Did they release a real-time XCOM? And I'll be like, no. No, he's just that good. And it's making the fucking instant transmission noise. <laughs> to make it even more unwatchable, I play the game in three times fast motion. People are literally crying, shitting and farting, wishing I would play slower because they can't tell what's going on. Did I die, Mr. Bagel? No! No, Chinatown, you did great. Kong Speedbump did a great job. You did fantastic, sweetie. <laughs> mark action comes back. I had to get rid of the mark emotes to make room for everyone's a moobot. I loved the mark commands. I loved action XCOM. Anyway, Portent's done, so that's cool. Remember, we How did BR plus you. drums work out? Eh, I wouldn't do it again. Let's just say... I wouldn't do it again. Let me back up my save and let's scan on the did you escape? I told you it'd be a three mission th I told you it would be a three mission day today. You all didn't believe me. Gave you that extra mission for free. I appreciate your efforts to support the research team, Commander. I've already put the new recruits. Incredon says VTuber do funny faces, react time. Yeah, okay, maybe. New engineers arrived this morning, Commander. No, we're not watching the DK sing. If you want me to if you want to be a fucking react VTuber, react VTuber, then you have to fucking queue it up. Put it in the new Discord channel, Beagle React to this. It doesn't exist yet, but Jeff's gonna make it. It's a new channel. It's a new channel, it's a new thread underneath like Beagle Rush fan art. It's like Beagle Beagle React to this, please. And then I'll ignore it. I'll fucking ignore it. I'll forget. I'm gonna. It, 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 two minutes and 45 seconds. I'm gonna forget I ever said this. Nice, 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 nice. Let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Run par. Uh, oh, I can get another officer thing. Sick. 
more, more shit. Okay, it's beam laser time, isn't it? Where the fuck is beams? <gasps> beams now, yeah. Beams, yes. I hope you enjoy ballistics, baby, because it's beam time. It's the top one out of two weapons that you'll enjoy using before Gauss. It's beam lasers. It's the weapon that's way better than ballistics, but not quite cool enough to be used until the end of the game like Gauss. It's beam. And it leaves me deciding what to get next. Advanced beam, I guess. I've, I've got one beam. Why not get more beams? Obviously. Did you see what I did with that flame bloody Cyclops VTuber fan out from like two years ago? I did, yeah. It's cute. Looks cute. Looks cute, Jeff. Good job. You're looking really handsome. Man, if I get alien materials, I can get alloy plates. I feel like ceramics aren't cutting it anymore with mutons. Maybe I should take a little whoop the a little a little a little detour in alien materials. I get some alloy plates. Uh, the Forgotten Dev says, would you prefer XCOM 3 to be more akin to EU, E dub, or 2? I have no fucking idea, man. I do not know how to answer that, because I love both the games. I don't know. I want it to be the best of both. How about that? I want it to be good. Make it good. Beagle, what the fuck are alien materials, you fool? Yeah, I, I don't know. I just never got it. <laughs> I guess we're going to take a little hoopsty doopsty skip over to alien materials. But I'm so close to advanced beam. Wouldn't it be cool to get advanced beam chat? Don't, don't let me forget. I'm going to go back to that. Now I need a couple of laser rifles for my beautiful infantry. They're so cute and sexy. I have so many alloys. Wow, I'm so good at the game. Oh my gosh. Um. What? Wait a minute. You just get the machine guns straight up. Oh, I'm thinking of XCOM 2. Oh, sick. It's the shotguns I don't get. Oh, sick. Oh, sick. I get Gatling lasers in, in two weeks. Oh, yes. Hang on, I gotta sell some shit. We didn't even get Landed Large. No, we didn't last time either, which I think is a good thing, because the Landed Large is the number one way to restart your campaign. So it's probably a good thing we didn't. You're sounding pretty moist about getting lasers. I am. I am very. Get alien mats to get advanced beam for now. Yeah, because it's not machine guns. It's only snipers and shotguns, and I can make that work. As long as you got your gats, yeah, we can get we can get alien mats. Holy shit! Double Gatling laser, fuck yeah! And double laser rifle, yeah, yeah, motherfucker, yeah! And then get a laser shatter ray, yeah, for the engineer. I need to get the laser pisses too for the infantry. It's really important. It's imp it's so important. I'll sell sixty dollars worth of bullshit right now just to get them. And then that just leaves the sniper. Another laser rifle for the medic would be nice. Okay, so I need forty five for that as well. And uh, that's that's like it, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes. Okay, forty five plus sixty is. $105. I need $105. Oh, God. Okay, yep, 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 yep. Okay, good. Lays supposed to come wait a bit when it's a ranger. You're probably right, but it's too late. I already did it. It's too late. I already did it. Okay, yeah. Nice. Hey, advanced beam is how I get better air game weapons though, right? That's like air game lasers, so I do need that. Beagle this month and you're about to be paid. I can't wait that day. I need to get the lasers now. Advanced beam allows me to get interceptor weapons. It better air game. Hmm. But Alien Materials lets me build alloy plates so I don't die to mutons. Mm. I think I think the new Interceptor lasers can wait tw uh, nine days. 
SBS says I'm in so much pain, you don't have an alien materials ready, you have no idea. Because I got Xenoneurology first and I did nothing with it. I don't know how I made that work last time. I must have been insane. I must have had like a different power setup. Probably because probably because I didn't go sats heavy last time. That's how I was able to afford a containment early. But it was like wasted research this time. Because I thought I could make it work like last time, but last time I had an alien containment up because I didn't build more sats, I guess. So, eh, you know, whatever. Gorg says, is there any lore to why Dissectors are all naked in both XCOM 1 and 2? It's like a Dobby thing. The Ethereals don't respect them. That's why they wear clothes in Chimera Squad, because they're free and they're not slaves. Alright. Scanning. Incoming transmission. What an awesome month. With the progress A for April. Project thus far, Commander. Your Five UFO rates. Look at me. Our expectations, and that is not a statement. This Look at me, makes go fun. chat. I'm the fucking best. We will be in touch, Commander. Look at all them free dollars. I guess I could have waited to buy the laser pistols. Yeah. What do I do with the free dollars? Time for sats. Well, to build a satellite uplink, I need the power. How much meld is that going to be? It's probably going to be like 1.5 times the money and like a whittle bitty meld. But yeah, maybe I should build sats and try to get two more sats up at the end of this month. Did laser cannons take the nose gun slot or the missile slot? I assume the cannon slot, but I have no idea. I assume the cannon slot, which will be really OP. I appreciate your efforts to support the research team, Commander. 17 Before days from now. The new recruits to work in the lab. I think even with Rush, I don't get the uplink up in time. 17 days. So it'll be the, the 17th of May. Thermo comes up. And then I rush build and like, well, I can ask us some companion. Um, satellite. Satellite uplink takes 11 days quick build. 17, 28. There's more than 28 days in May. So, okay, I could make it work. With a rush build, I could get a satellite uplink built by the end of the month and get two more satellites up. Bounty says exact time. How many, how many days are in May? If it's the exact time, we can't do it because of the bug. Um, how many days in May? 31. There's 31 days in May. Okay. So, it would be the 18th. 29, 30, 31. We might get screwed on the lost time of traveling, right? Should account for it already. It don't. It don't. Uh. They could probably do it. Yeah, like three days and it's only 11 days of travel time. I can probably get it done. Because it's only 11 days because it's rush build. So as long as I don't fuck around on the Geoscape too long without scanning, as long as I don't fuck around like with air game interceptions too much, I can probably do it and then I can get another one up over Germany and then another country of my choice that will not only kick in the 140 per month from Germany, it will also kick in um, monthly XCOM funding increase by 20%, which is a massive boost, which will let me then have enough money to buy advanced laser interceptor weapons by next month. Uh, and deal of exalt, which is unfortunately this month, uh, and get armor. So, it, it definitely pays off. I think it definitely pays off. And then you can put another one in the U.S. and then you can build another uplink, and you could take Canada and Mexico. Dangerous new equipment down there. And then you lower your air game budget, and then together with Europe's plus twenty percent. Plus North America's minus d discount off air game, plus all the money from all these satellites, I will probably have enough credits to run that many air games. You did pick a research, right? Yeah, I did. I did. Okay, I think we can do it. I think we can make it happen. Commander, 
Our current satellite uplink facilities are no point building them yet, but I think we can make it happen. Additional uplinks as soon as possible to allow for new satellite deployments. The last time is just the scavengers or interceptors again. It's anytime you're not clicking scan bounty, I believe. So interceptors will count too. But I think we can make it happen. I think we can do this. If anything, I really need to make make some time to recruit some more soldiers to to get leveling up. They're like $30 each though, right? They're like so fucking expensive. Like 25 gods, they're so expensive. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta get the satellites. I can't afford it. I can't afford it. SWF says I tried to track down that scanning bug and I suspect it's bullshit but didn't put in the work to prove it. It's absolutely not bullshit. What, so, something is causing it because we've seen it fuck us this uh, on March out of some money. We, something like it exists. That's for sure. How's the hangar going? Good, the hangar is good. The hangar is good. Okay, scanning. Scopes are here. Hip hip hooray. Mm, yes, hip hip hooray. A little bit of time off is always nice. Commander, there's a priority. Oh my, Newfoundland time. In Interesting. Oh! <gasps> Zangers. Well, you better be here tomorrow. For the biggest fucking mission of your life, kids. It's friends in low places. And, and this mission really ends campaigns. This mission is very difficult. It is a very difficult mission. Scopes are in play for it, but not lasers. If I hadn't done Xena Neurology, I would have lasers for friends in low places. This is going to be fucking hard with ballistics. It's a hard mission. It really is. I always get through it right on the skin of my teeth. I'd like to try and, like, do better this time, please. I'm going to take four gunners. <laughs> I'm going to take four fucking gunners. I'm going to take, like, engineers with sapper grenades. I don't know what I'm going to do, but I don't want to get fucked up like last time because I, I need my Zang, man. I need my Zang. If you did your tech right, you could have Gauss before Gangplank too. Jesus, that's insane. Gauss rush, insane. Wait, you could have Gauss by now? This isn't Gangplank. Oh, Gangplank, right. Never mind. Confident that you will handle this matter with discretion. Anyway, at least mo I was gonna say my whole roster's here, but never fucking mind. Oh wow, it really isn't. Hey, but the specialists have arrived. Oh baby, you're gonna wanna be here tomorrow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten new XCOM soldiers just dropped, kids. And if you wanna get a raffle in, you better be here for that. I'll give you one raffle right now for all the people who exclamation mark raffle today, and I'll save the other nine for tomorrow. Exclamation mark raffle if you want to be one of them. I'm just gonna- I don't know if they're gonna be on ne the next mission, but I'm gonna raffle one of them right now. I mean, they might die because it's friends in low places as well, but you know. At least I've got scout infantry infantry, two corporal infantry is really big deal. Uh, engineer, medic, sniper. I've got everything else. I just need like a, a specialist gunner. I'm not gonna have the hollow gunner, which sucks, but I will have the flush gunner. It could be you, yeah. So it's gotta be... Jorgen Johnson or Renato Borges. I love these names. Jorgen Johnson. It could be you. Get your raffle in. It could be you right the fuck now. And the other nine will pro probably be sometime tomorrow. Because um, I'm probably going to need those soldiers at some point soon. Okay, here we go. The winner is... JMC924 for Jorgen Johnson. It's like Soldier 76 over here. Soldier 89. J Jorgen Johnson JMC924. JMC924. There you go. You're in. Congratulations, jo Jorgen. No, it's pronounced Jorgen. Jorgen. Actually. Oh, there you go. You're in, Jorgen. 
Jorgen? Now you got me saying it wrong. It's Jorgen. That's right, Jojo. Jorgen JMC924 Johnson Jojo. Correct. He is a Jojo. And just for that, he should get fucked up looking purple armor. Because Jojo is all about purple shit. There you go. Now you're purple. Boom. Hey, you took my Jojo loadout away. There you go. Jorgen Johns. Jorgen Jojo. <laughs> JMC. <laughs> All right. That's tomorrow's operation, but it's not today's. Thank you for coming. We're going to look at... Uh, we're going to thank the subs and subs. We're going to raid someone, and that's it for today. I'll be back tomorrow for more XCOM Long War. We play that mission tomorrow and some other ones, probably. Uh, and then we will be playing XCOM 2 multiplayer. Yeah, we're going, to watch the, we're going to watch the fucking stupid videos. We're going to watch the Mario trailer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right now. But hang on. I'm doing my outro for the people who want to leave. Um, yeah, M multiplayer XCOM 2 after that, so if you haven't seen it before, uh, yada yada, big, big whoop, I kind of am a big deal playing XCOM 2 single player campaign, but it's multiplayer, my friends, my wife and friends play the Aliens and Advent, and it is fucking hard as nails, and I am getting the shit beat out of me, and it is incredibly fun and exhilarating, um, but also really hard and painful, so yeah. It is really good. It's like XCOM you've never seen before. Do check it out. It's not tomorrow. It's the day after tomorrow. And the day after that. That's our two XCOM multiplayer days. All right. <sighs> Save an exit out of this. Educational? Oh, uh, yeah. I've tagged myself as educational. I am an educational streamer, so that's just true. What's this link, Mr. Blinky? Uh, I... What the fuck is this? No, I don't want to look at this. I don't want to look at the Donkey Kong Sings shit. Fine. Okay, hang on. I'm gonna watch, I'm gonna show you fuckers. We got like 10 minutes of videos to watch and then I'm out of here. Um, so the first thing I'm gonna show you guys is, I guess I'm gonna show you this dumb bullshit now, hang on. I don't think I have, unless there's like in, insane fan art, I wanna save it for tomorrow because I wanna get out of here, I'm already over time. Okay, there isn't like insane fan art. So I'm gonna save the fan art for tomorrow. Um, and by fan art, I mean, I like X Slayer's little upscaled things in Fan Art Gallery for my little PNG, man. I like those. Oh, I gotta make a note to myself to do the, the Canadian South Park bullshit. Because if I don't remember to do that, I'm scamming that person over $125. Okay. Ma Mouth Park. Why did I just know that was Mouth Park? I'm really smart, that's why. Mouth Park Wolf. Okay. Uh... Okay. You wanted to do the speech people thing? Yeah, I'm noting that down too. My, my notes literally say rant mode with bubble for seek tube. So there you go. Buy rap. Okay. So now I gotta watch this crap. I mean, I'm not crap. This is beautiful, of course. It's wonderful. Let me close my blades. Okay, so for some reason I'm expected to watch this. That's the fakest plane I've ever heard. Let's find out. Jesus Christ. Anyway, look, you can't really follow that, but this is the last thing I'm gonna show you guys. It's a new assault video. Unlike most of the assault video, most of the assault videos are about how jets rule. Um, this video is about the A-10. Wow, I hear you little screaming monkeys all shout and clap. Oh, the A-10, my favorite. Can't wait for Bert. Can't wait for Hang on. No, hang on. I can't do it. There it is. No, it's gone again. Anyway. That's what, that's not going to be what happens here. This is what we were, we were talking about the A-10 in uh, XCOM the last couple of weekends. And Nassault was listening and he was like, tell you what Biggs, I'll show your viewers about the A-10. Okay, teach us about the A-10, Nassault. Teach us how great the A-10 is.
Huh? Oh, we're good. We took a hit on the stream. But we're alright. There, there's the A-10 being great for about three minutes. Thank you, Nassault. Hey, Cypher, you hear me? Just look at the view. There's not much difference between those countries from up here. <laughs> How brave of Nassault to make a video of just A-10s exploding for four minutes. Who do plan is up? I never played this Ace Combat, but my understanding is, um, my understanding is that there is a mission in Zero, in Ace Combat Zero, where there's like this giant fortress called Gladysense. Um, no, I've never played Zero. I've never played Ace Combat Zero as to Zero, like going, you what, in chat? Um, and you have to like go assault it, I believe. I don't know. That's all I know of it. All I know of it is from the Assault videos. And assault, this is actually kind of a remake. Assault did a, a Gla uh, Gladysense video uh, before as well. But yeah, very, very brave, very brave of Nassault to show this to us. So basically, if I'd waited like two weeks to have the A-10 like distraction from a couple of weekends ago, I could have just played this video. We could have just done that of like AA just exploding A-10s. <laughs> All right. It's, this is from like mission seven or eight. Yeah, I've never played Zero. I really should sometime, but it's, um, it's, uh, I didn't have the PlayStation at the time. So I, I think you can like... <laughs> emulate it or something now to, to play it. So maybe one day, I don't know. I mean, maybe I'll play it on my PS2 sometime. But anyway, that's that's the day, man. Thank you to Assault for another great video, by the way. I always enjoy it. It's different from his usual ones of, like, Jets being the fucking best. Hey, I guess I can give you, like, a palate cleanser now, right? At the time, you still don't? I don't know. I can't even remember what I just said, Jeff. I guess, I, I guess like, watching A10's Explode for 4 minutes gives me the, the right to do a palate cleanser now, right? Do I get to watch Invincible Fleet... Or Emancipation. They're both pretty good, but I feel like Emancipation's like the better one. Invisible Fleet is sick. 
But it, it's like the opposite of that video where the sea whisk hits nothing, <laughs> which is funny. You have to emulate. Yeah. Well, as long as it's fine then. Emancipation. Emancipation has the sickest shit in it. Invisible Fleet is cool as fuck, but we're gonna watch Emancipation for a palate cleanser. And then I'm literally out of here. Then I'm gonna read my subs and I'm gonna raid you somewhere. This is one of his older ones, but it's still really good. The end of it slaps. San Salvajan was a neutral city at the start of the war until the illusions occupied it. We will now liberate this city. The heaviest resistance will come from the tank battalion near Route 7 in Old Town, and the anti-tank helicopters near the new city government complex. In addition, you must defend our allies from any airstrikes that may originate from the airport behind you. The resistance fighters will end the blackout over the city. Suppress all enemy resistance and help liberate the city. Resistance will end the blackout any minute now. That'll be our signal. Countdown. Three, two. Talk about the thing about the rotors. Nah, fuck it. Okay, so I can't resist. So we talked about this last time when someone said it made them fun at a party because of an interesting fact. But on these helicopter models with the dual rotors and shit. There's little explosive charges, as I understand it, on the end of the rotors that blow them off in case of an ejection. So when you try to eject out of the cockpit seat, it blows the rotors off so that you don't get fucking blended by the rotors when you try to eject, because these helicopters have ejection seats. It's a fun little fact, okay? It's a fun fact! Tell it to people at parties, okay? Avalis is even more fun fact about the left from recent events as the principles are unreliable. Oops. <laughs> oh god. That's awful. We apologize for the momentary disruption of this live broadcast. That's that's not a very fun fact, is it?
I love watching anime Ace Combat protagonists just built different. The city has been liberated. How do you dodge five missiles? Just fly straight into them and flare and roll. Why don't any of them ever hit you? Because he's built different, that's why. Mobius is just built different. Have you been hit by missiles? You should have been like Mobius, he's just built different. How come missiles... How come Mobius' missiles never get flared and they always hit? Built different. Valus said it's easy when you're in a 15 undefeated 808 king. Yeah. Emancipation's a good one. I enjoy emancipation. Huh. Well, that's it. That's all your fun for the day. That's done. We're done now. We're done with fun. Is this allowed? No. Whatever that is, it's not allowed. We had no interceptions today. I, I don't know why I'm watching Ace Combat videos and we had no interceptions today. Thanks you full on fun. Yeah, good for you. We're gonna we're gonna do subs and dubs now. And I'm gonna get the fuck out of here. I'm gonna raid. So thanks to I can do all my subs and dubs for a day. Yeah, shit. Okay, I think we're gonna raid. I want to raid over Ez because she donated like fifteen dollars to me to shit post in Italian. So that's kind of like paying for a raid. Is over Ez on? She's usually on. Over Ez is not on, so I cannot raid back over Ez. She stopped streaming six hours ago. Wait, what? Wait, what? Six hours ago is when I started my stream. Seven. Oh, so she just finished. That's... my brain doesn't understand. Or just started? Was she shitposting while she was streaming? Anyway. Who else is on? Um, Blueberry Gabby is playing Tarkov. No one else I raid usually is on. Sure. I think she's done that before. What a champion. What an absolute champ. I mean, she, she basically paid for a raid back with those $50 donations. Now I can't, now I can't do it. Fuck. Uh, I guess we're doing Blueberry Gabby in a sec. Okay, let me thank my subs and dubs. Does that, unless someone in chat has a good suggestion for a raid target and we could raid someone else today. SBS says I'm a sub if I paid for a raid. Probably. I mean, if you streamed us to you, if I would, I would probably raid you, so yeah. But you haven't made the funny Italian man talk, so I don't know him. Vote Pyro for Prez to subscribe for 64 months in a row. Thank you for your Nintendo 64 subs. What if in Twitch integration, every time... <laughs> someone talked in it, it spoke in the Italian TTS. She called the subscriber for 44 months. Scotty Bob, 26 months sub. Isaac, 13 months sub. JWeb, 40 months sub. The Annoying Flying Thing, 18 months. Snake Lady, 49 months. Self-harmonize with the very big generous tier 3 sub. Thank you for the tier 3 sub 55 months. Self-harmonize, very kind of you. I appreciate it. Papa Minix, 56 months sub. Jake Monora, 88 months sub. JMC, 924, 48 months sub. Gusting your four years of subbing. Thank you very much, JMC, 924. I appreciate it. Noobs are 99, 57 months sub. Uh, here we are. Egg, donate, $5. I don't have to read these messages out again. Though I guess I can just replay them, right? The council is requesting your attention. <laughs> huh? What's this? Huh? Ah! Egg has just oh. tipped the cinque dollari. Mamma mia, my penis is small. Oh, I didn't think I'd clicked it. I was confused there. I was like, what? She's donating again? I, I fooled myself. Anyway, yeah. Uh, Dr. Rio donated five dollars. I should just... <laughs> if I just click them all, does it queue them up? Commander, the council is requesting your attention. <laughs> Dri has just tipped the cinque dollari. <laughs> Mamma mia, I ate that fucker Jeff Bezos. <laughs> does it does it queue them up? Does it do the next one? No, it only does one at a time. Oh no, no, no! Oh, it does queue them up! Britannia has just tipped 5 dollars. <laughs> Hope you burn in hell. You're so FN loud. Head to get up. Blue Dragon, thanks for the three years of subbing. I appreciate it very much. Thank you for the three years in a row. Uh, Incredons, we're not replaying because it was the one that went for fucking ever. Bitterfell, 18 month sub. But thank you for the five dollars, Incredon. Uh, egg, another $10. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Cavi Rose, gift of the sub to Megabert. Thank you for that. Cavi Rose. There's an Oz guy streaming Terra Invicta. Sounds like he'll steal my audience. Can't read him. 
Egg donated another $5, Piffledor $5, Croker $5, Dr. Danger $5, Eleven Castle $5. Thank you all very much for giving the donations today. I really appreciate it. Um, they give me instant money. They Twitch doesn't take half of them, so I get a lot more out of donations than anything else. Thank you very much. I really, really, really big appreciate it. Uh, it helped me. Out. It helps me out a ton, and like literally today, it has helped me out a ton. So thank you so much. I always appreciate it. Thank you so much. Um, the Forgotten Death, 12 month sub, got a year of subbing in a row. BR plus jump for the win. The Big 44 month sub. Big thank you to Monsieur Target for the $25 of donations. I appreciate that very much, Monsieur Target. Very, very kind. Thank you. Mr. Bilky, $10 donation, who just said crumb over and over. Thank you for that, for the $10. Very kind, and I appreciate it a lot. Thank you. Um, the guy streaming Terra and Victor is a self-proclaimed long war veteran. Well, I've, I, I don't know. What's his name? Shalkar, 49 month sub. ZVMD, thank you very much for your $5 donation. I appreciate it a lot. And for your kind message, too, Commander, can I just say. Let's replay that one. That's a nice one. ZVMD is just the tip $5. Dollari. Forte smartest commander alive. It's great. I can just replay them whenever I want. Whenever I feel down, I can just replay these nice messages. Thank you. Nick Spinicus, 84 months sub. Jeff Ronks, 53 months sub. Equ Equilibrium, 17 months. Neurodeviant, 51 months. Cron Oblivion, welcome to subscribing with Twitch Prime. Thank you for spending your Prime subscription on me. I appreciate it a lot. Thank you very much. Cloudy AK, 13 months sub. Godzilla Goes Rao, 38 months sub. Stormy Jeb, 9 months. Guessing your sub, baby. Stormy Jeb. MJB Love. HB Go Papuri, 71 months sub. SDF says, without a nice message, I have no idea what the Italian voice said. It's very simple. The voice said, for the smartest... I'll play it again for you. For the smartest commander alive. Oh, I think I just clicked it twice. I'm sorry. <laughs> ZVMD is just $5. For the smartest commander alive. See, for the smartest commander alive, who didn't queue it up twice. So there you go. He's a genius. Pwn Swag, 2 months sub. Tango Dash 1, 34 months sub. Thank you very much. Jedi Wombat, $6.43. Thank you for the donation. Appreciate it very, very much. I leave it. <laughs> thank you for the donation. Um, thank you to uh, Brit, who gifted the sub to Moobot. Thank you for the gift sub to Moobot. Keep Moobot running, Brit. Wong to Og, gifted the sub to Harlan TV. Thank you for the gift sub to my long suffering lurkers who just want to see gameplay. I'm, I'm so sorry. Momentary Raid of the Party at 2. Magna Farda subscribed. Sniffin' J, 66 month sub. Anarchy Paladin, 9 months. Guessing your sub, baby. Nictus of the Mafia, 5 month sub. Thank you so much. And then big donations here, which I have to replay all of them because they were big donations. Uh, $50 from Wong to Og. Uh, they say it best. Just let them say it. Wait, did I not? Commander, oh, <laughs> it takes a minute. <laughs> Wong Tao GG has just tipped 50 dollars. It's a memario. I am so excited to see a Canadian beagle. Yes, it is a me Mario. Thank goodness. Uh, and Wong to Og also fifty-five dollars. The council is requesting your attention. Wong Tao GG has just tipped 55 dollars. Please, Beagle, don't lose house. Waiting for Long War Live and Legendary <laughs> Part 7 already gives me PTSD. <laughs> he can't lose you for another 5 years. Why am I replaying them? Well, I don't know, but I'm gonna do the last one because I did the rest. So Cam donating $125 as well. The last donation of the day. Thank you so much. I don't know why I'm doing this, but here we go. Here it goes again. Zakam has just tipped 125 dollars. <laughs> South Park that avatar you coward. Ilunga K, but really, do it. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it! Yeah, absolutely. Thank you for the $125 donation, Zakam. It's super helpful. Thank you so much. Wong to Og also of the uh, 50 and the 55, $105 total donation for Wong to Og as well. I appreciate it a lot. Thank you guys very, very much. Thank you all my guys, girls, and MBs. Where is the Incredon one for like an hour? We're not doing Incredon or Blinky's one because Blinky's one was also just crumb, 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 crumb. All right, so we're gonna raid now. So I guess I'm gonna raid uh, Blubbergabby. Who's playing Escape from Tarkov? Unless I can find someone new to raid. Did you guys, do you guys remember raiding Blubbergabby? Did you enjoy raiding her? Do you wanna go there again or do you want me to find you somewhere new? I, maybe I'll, I mean, maybe I can look for new streamers. I just like raid VTubers, honestly, like... It's because they're who I click on. Like, I see, like, twi Twitch white men. Or, like, I don't know, I just see, like, Twitch men. I don't click their cameras, because I'm like, what's well, a man? That's not exciting to me. I'm a man. I'm, I'm not exciting. 
But then I see like a VTuber, I'm like, oh man, that's different. That's different. Me click. Me click that. You know, and, and that's how they get me. Oh wow. I'm doing the exact same thing now. There's a there's a stylish looking Japanese VTuber playing Tarkov. <laughs> this is what I do now. I just I just raid VTubers. Uh who's Candace? Socials 18 plus LGBTQIA plus transgender English. That sounds like a good raid target. The Hank Hill VTubers not on Sag. Sag. I think maybe this is where we're going. To the... <laughs> she, her, transgender, LGBTQIA plus anxiety VTuber English. Those are tags you can get down with. Right? That's all good. Is there sound though? Are you muted? Is there sound? Or are you so anxious you don't have a microphone? I, maybe I can't hear it over my Winamp. Win Winamp, shut the fuck up! It's straight up muted. Is the is the stream crashed? There's there's no sound. How can I send you all to a stream with no sound? Can't do it. Maybe maybe I gotta find someone else. I don't know. Maybe maybe it's just a muted stream. You know what? Fuck it. I gotta get out of here. You're going here anyway. Figure it out. Ask ask her. Fuck it. Ask her what the deal is, not me. But don't ask her too aggressively, because it's an anxiety tag. <laughs> so, don't, don't be, <laughs> don't be anxious, chat. Don't, don't ask in an anxiety-inducing way. Just pop in and like put a little smiley face on the end of whatever you say. Like, hey, where, where the fuck is your sound? Smiley face. No, don't do that. Don't actually say that. Be cool. Be cool. Be cool. Anxiety tag playing talk of it's a relaxing game for some of us. Once you've accepted, you're already dead. All right. Well, I know she's got sound because she's wearing ear pro, so it's gonna be on. Anyway, I'll catch you guys tomorrow for more XCOM. I hope you enjoyed the extra mission today. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I hope you did. I hope you fucking did, chat. All right. Um. Yeah. I'll see you fuckers all tomorrow for more XCOM and more XCOM multiplayer afterwards. Bye bye, everyone. Have a good one. I enjoyed having you today, so I'll see you tomorrow for more XCOM. Have a good one. Cheerio. What the fuck did I say Cheerio? That's biggest Pickus' fault. Goodbye! Commander, the Council is requesting your attention. MR trattino basso Bill Chies just tipped 10 dollari. CRUM 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 CRUM